What's up, Fitted Squad? This is Brad, aka Drew Fitted, coming to you with another quick video. And today is going to be a pretty uh, quick and simple one. Um, basically, I'm going to go over the plans for the Ultima. Um, instead of kind of drawing it out, I'm going to be bagging the Ultima here pretty soon. Um, it was supposed to have been done already. However, found out that the management is on the national back order. So that, as well as the lines, didn't show up in time. So I got a lot of prep work recorded and set up and then we got to the installation part and that's where we were kind of held up. So I didn't want to just put that out because um, that would have been a pretty anticlimactic ending. So that's going to come when we actually do the installation. Uh, but I'll show you at least a little bit what we got so far and kind of go over the next steps and stuff like that. But yeah, so we didn't actually get... Um, an ETA for it just that they are working on it that's pretty much it so we'll I don't know how long it's gonna be honestly all right so this is the issue I'm running into right now this heavy box keeps sliding all right so I have the wood flooring in I need to button up the sides because they do come up a little bit but I do have some grips on the bottom of the box, but it's still sliding. So I'm going to work on that. Um, looks like that's sliding as well. So I'm going to work on it. Um, I got some other ones that should be bigger. I'm not sure if that's going to work or not. But we'll give that a shot before we try actually bolting it down. Because this is a big and heavy box, as you can see, to be sliding around. Um, I don't, haven't really been putting anything in the trunk with it um, the main issue I've had so far is I've had it get up under the arms a couple times where I couldn't open up uh, normally because see it comes down so I've had that issue um, it was pretty simple because I, I can get my arm in enough and push it or if need be I can go through the back because I used to keep my seats down so but yeah um haven't really been driving it too much um since of course I work from home but also um yeah I don't really go too many places right now so this should be but buttoned up here in the next day or two um I'm not huge on driving it like this the other thing that has happened is let's see if you can see it back there now nah, you can't see it from this angle but the star headliner let me get to it star headliner has become unplugged and looks like it yeah it's still plugged in for now um and that's quick and easy easy to put back but that's just the casualty of this box moving everywhere um, but yeah, uh, most likely I'm probably going to put the tank just in front of this. I was thinking about putting it up here, but I think it just makes more sense for it to just be down here. Um, I thought about putting it behind it and just making a little setup that way, but I do want to see it when I open the trunk. So we'll go ahead and do that. Put the management on the side uh, and a compressor. Might do dual compressors so I can air out more often. Most likely I am going to. Um, depending on how long it takes for everything to show up, I might end up doing that before I do everything else. Um, but we'll see, we'll see. Um, as far as what's been going on, I mean, we've been waiting for that mostly. Um, been busy with a bunch of orders lately, so th thanks for that. Uh, have had some issues with this rotor. So I'm probably going to have to get that refinished because that's actually pretty bad. Um, had an issue with one of the brake pads back here. So that's pretty scratched up. But the rest of them are not. So the rest of them are like that. So they are fine. I'm actually also in the process of doing another banner. Um, as you can see, these are two separate materials, so the color is a little off. That's the original material. That's the newer material. Um, that one was actually put on 
after that one. But um, I'm not a fan of this material. They got the top coat coming off, the colors coming off. Original still holding on strong. Um, I'm debating if I'm going to just change the the actual banner color, but I'm also thinking about just doing a redesign altogether because I've been having quite a few of the homies who have an issue with the bottom peeling up. Now, when I had the original one, the gold one for my old wheels, that one I didn't have any issues, but when I went to this one in different material, I have been having some issues with the points. So I might change up the design on the Fitted Squad logo for the squad. So stay tuned for that. I think I'm, I'm actually gonna do that. But yeah, still not decided on the color I'm gonna run. Was thinking, staying with the blue. Also thinking of going with the wheel color, going with the Neo Chrome, but we'll see. But I gotta run to the store really quick, so let me go ahead and do that, and I'll pick up the camera either when I get there or get back. Oh yeah, another thing I wanted to kind of talk about, um, I just got this dash cam, just did a video on it, and I ran into a few issues with it so far. Um, just based off of me running the base and everything, what tends to happen is it starts to shift it'll automatically start to tilt when it's running and instead of it facing down it'll start to aim up now what i'm trying to do um, i tilted it as far down as it can go and that gets some of the hood so it's not getting all of the well it is getting all of the street but it's not getting just the street it's getting some of the hood of the car i'm gonna try that to see if it'll stay in that setting enough um that i can basically keep using it with the music playing um, if not I may have to go back to my old camera um, but we'll see or maybe even switch with my wife or something like that because um, she has the second one that was sent out and this is the newest the third one so we'll see we'll see um, but yeah let me try I'm gonna try to test it a little bit more um, see if that works all right so this is what I mean as if you can see this is the front. You see, it's facing up instead of down, so you can get that. So, uh, I did do a little testing, and it seems like as soon as I get to the volume that I usually keep it at, it, it falls right away. Um, if I do maybe three points lower, depending on the song, it might stay up, um, but for the most part, it's going to start moving. So, I'm definitely gonna only way I could keep it is if I found something I can stick up here that's going to get it to stay which I think is more trouble than it's worth so I think I'm just gonna switch this with the one that's in my wife's car um, and since they use the same cables it's really just plug and play um, so I think I'm gonna do that if she's cool with that otherwise I'm gonna be getting a different dash cam the quality is great though um, I definitely don't want to be without a dash cam so um, I don't know how she'll feel about this one in her face um, but of course see you can just push that up and or can turn it off altogether so I'll leave that up to her but um yeah let's go look at the trunk to see how the box is shifted and this is without me driving crazy too so let's take a look no editing slow yep right at the front <laughs> yeah my um, grip should be here so yeah but um got on a dirt bike he looked like he tried to do a wheelie but caught itself but that's pretty much gonna do it for this video um just a quick little update on what's coming up with the Ultima um, I'd like to thank you all for tuning in please like comment subscribe and as always oh actually let me know what you guys think of the new outro all right and as always stay fitted peace